So today we're going to talk about scapular stability, and this is very common in a lot of high school kids. You have basically as a rounded or a forward shoulder position when the lower portion of the scapula kind of sticks out or we'll classify this as wingy. This effect basically is you want to get this arm to be back here and loaded up. Like hitting coach for this is scap loaded. I'm going to call this a scap retraction. But when you get into a good hitting position, grab that PVC drum and put it in your hand from it and just kind of hold that like you're going to hit. So you want to now go through your stride. So you want to basically be in this position where you go back through and this is loaded and pulled back. A lot of times if this is unable and he's not strong enough to pull this back, what's going to happen is the shoulder head's going to relax from me. The shoulder head's going to stay forward to the bat, then him going back when he thinks he's loaded. Now the bat tips forward and then what has to happen, we have to reroute and we have to go through and everything kind of collapses. Or the other way where this stays forward and the body extends up here and we basically go into lower back extension in order for him to get what he feels is scap loaded as opposed to being able to get loaded up into this proper position. So a couple exercises to really help that out and have down the on the stomach on the ground. <clears throat> Grab those weights. Let's go, uh, let's go T position first on me. So we're gonna come right back through here. He's gonna keep the bill of the cap on the ground. We're gonna keep the shoulder blades down away from the ears. And all we're gonna do from here is have Dominic keeping his head down, raise his hands up here, pause. But I'm gonna add one more thing into here so we lower back down. Now I'm gonna raise up and I want him to turn the palms of his hands up towards the sky. So we're getting a little bit more of that shoulder external rotation. Come back down. Good, we're gonna go through that again. Raise up, externally rotate. Very good, come back down. This motion, that little bit of that turn, is really challenging on that shoulder to be able to, again, we want this shoulder to be back and able to externally rotate when it's in that loaded position of the scap load position of hitting. Another great one is gonna be more of a W position, which is gonna kinda of emulate the more of the hitting posture because we want to get the hand more in this W position. So from here, again, keeping the cap on the ground, the baseball cap on the ground, we're going to pull up. And again, we're going to try and do a little external rotation. Come back down. Again, pull the shoulder blades down. We really want to make the shoulder blades squeeze together. Come back up. And then externally rotate. Pause. One, two. Come back down. So those two exercises.